at chord progression. So today we're going to look at the chord progression for memories. Um, so it's a eight chord sequence. Let's look at them. Uh, first one. show you how the left hand line goes first Rhythm, okay. Let's look at the rhythm first. The rhythm is okay. Uh, so right hand first chord B D sharp F sharp and play D sharp and F sharp at the same time. Three notes are on the sharp notes. Okay, so F sharp, A sharp, C sharp. You can play those three notes together. Now these two chords together with the rhythm. Ooh, that's a bit tricky. It's much easier to. <laughs> The tapping out the left hand to play the left hand. So, if you don't mind me doing that, okay. Uh, our third and fourth chords we have our G sharp, G sharp, oh, sorry, G sharp minor, G sharp, B, and D sharp. And same texture as the first chord, we have bass note. And the third first together. Uh, the fourth chord we have our D sharp minor, D sharp, F sharp, A sharp. Again, those are three notes on the the sharp notes. Okay, the, um, but don't be, don't feel taken aback, really. See, there's a pattern. All of them are on the um, sharp. They are all sharp notes like this. Uh, together, the third and fourth chord together. Again. Mm -hmm. Now let us look at our. Those are our, our, our fifth and sixth chords. Uh, e, right, and then you have the G sharp and B. Again, uh, you play your bass note, root note on its own, and the third and fifth together, G sharp and B together. Um, next, we have B. B, D sharp, F sharp, and play those three notes together. And now, these two, 
two chords together. Nice. Well, we're nearly there. Let's look at the last two chords. And the good news is we um, repeat the E chord as our seventh chord. And we have already looked at our E chord. And the last chord is our F sharp chord. F sharp, A sharp, and C sharp. Okay, and the timing, I like it when there's a pattern to it, right? So it's... Bye.